Hi students, coming to the next topic that is the information flow matrix. So, so far we have discussed about the functional point analysis and line of code. Now let us see the information flow matrix. So by Henry and Kafra, uh, they are saying that they attempt to measure the complexity of code of measuring the flow of information from one processor to another in terms of fans in and fans out. So these two persons are going... Uh, uh, calculated the flow of information from one processor to another so one processor is sending information another processor is receiving again that in, uh, processor is sending information and this processor is going to be received so the attempts that is going to be measured attempts or measure the complexity of code of measuring the flow of information from one processor to another were calculated in terms of fan ins and fan outs so how you are going to calculate the fan ins? Fan in means number of local flow, uh, flows into a processor means local flow direction. A message that will be passed inside exits if either a module invokes a second module pass information to it or invoked module returns to the result. So just like a passing information that is a, you have to calculate the number of local flows into a processor plus number of global structure means it exists in uh, if information flow from one module to another via global data structure so the number of global structures read by processor so the fan in will be calculated the number of local fo flows in processor so in the processor how many flows are uh, entering means the input that we are entering plus the global structure you are reading by processor means the global structure we are reading from outside from the user so that calculates the fan in and coming to the fan out fan out is going to calculate the number of local flows from a processor means this is in means inside to the system user system so this is a in number of local flows into a processor Okay, plus number of globally stru global structure read by the processor. And whereas fan out means number of local flows from processor. From user to a system is nothing but here a processor. The number of local flows from a processor plus the global structures updated by the processor. Means after execute uh, completion of the execution the output is sent to the uh, users so along with the local flows of processor I, I need to calculate the number of global structures updated by the processor so this is a formula of calculating the uh, flow in means uh, the method the flow in and the flow out then how the flow represents how the flow will be represented in the processor the information flow into a processor via the augment list so always the information flow will be taking place into the processor via the augment list means that the attributes you are using the variables you are using the functions that are you using so that indicates the information flow into a processor so the information flow into a processor via the argument list and the flows from the processor due to return values of function calls. So always from the processor means always the return values. To the processor means argument list. So you have to, if you, if you want to read the data, you need argument list. That is the information flow that we have taken from the user. Okay, if you, if you want to execute, you have to return the value. You have to return the value. That is from the processor you have to return. Uh, that is a function calls. That is the out. So F in F F out. So this is a flow representation. The main thing, the flow means it's just not a, a passing. It's just a variables that you are using while the while input and the output and the functions that you are using for inputting and outputting. That you call it as a flow. So here the flow representation for into the processor or the argument list. Argument list and whereas the Return values of function calls from the processor is a flow represents. So thus the complexity of a processor P can be calculated as CP. The complexity of processor is equal to fan in into fan out square. So this is a formula of calculating the complexity of processor. Thank you.